What's going on, everybody? I am the goods on YouTube, TG So Good over on Twitter. So you guys make sure you follow me there. But before you go over to Twitter and leave a follow or even leave a like on this video, I want you guys to know today's video, we're going to be looking at a new plugin from Louie or Louia, uh, L O O Y H 1 3 over on Twitter. You guys. You probably want to follow him also, but make sure you follow me. This is a free camera plugin. So I'm going to show you some screenshots that he was able to take using the camera plugin. Now, as you can see, this one is in instant replay mode. So you're able to zoom out as far as you want. And uh, today I'm going to download it to see if I can zoom in as far as I want, get the angles that I want. But take a look at these screenshots, screenshots that you could not take before. Um, what would be the point of these screenshots? Maybe, you know, maybe some of you are in forums where you post screenshots so you could use them there or you could use them for reference if you're a modder to see certain things that you've edited in games especially stuff like uh, huge arenas or outdoor environments and if you are a content creator whether it be video or written content uh, cause there's some people that still write stories about their, my careers, um, TikToker, anything like that using digital media. You can use this for your thumbnails and screenshots for your content. So not only could you use it for screenshots, you could also use it for video. But anyway, um, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get into this. I'm going to show you how to download it and where to put the file even though he tells you exactly where to put the file. So first and foremost, you're going to need the NBA 2K hook files already. You, you need those already in your NBA 2K22 folder. So let me see if I can show you guys what that will look like. Uh, NBA. All right. So this is my NBA 2K22 folder. And of course, I've got way probably way more stuff than what you guys will have. But the important things here are that you have this hook folder as well as there's some files down here that you need to have i believe well it's one of these i think i believe it's this one here and this one here all right so now that you guys know which files you need. But if you if you've installed the NBA 2K hook before and you already have mods running, then you have these folders. But anyway, what you want to do is get into your 2K22 folder, go to that NBA 2K hook folder and double click it. And inside of there, you want to go to scripts. And as you can see inside of scripts, I already have a few scripts so I can do a few different things that some of you may not be able to do. If you don't have these scripts, make sure you go and download them uh, a little bit later in this video. I'll get around to talking more about the scripts, but let's go ahead and download. And I'm going to download this in real time. All right. Click over here to download. And all right. Now I just need to get to my downloads folder. So however you, whatever you do to get to your downloads folder, that's what you should do at this time. Downloads. All right. So we've got the free camera plugin uh, or whatever you want to call it yourself. I'm going to double click inside that zip file. And there we're going to have a free camera dot Lua file. What I want to do is get that over exactly to where he said to put it, which is you want to put it in your 2K22, then your 2K hook and scripts folders. So I already have that folder open here. Again, you can see the full address here. All right. But my 2K22 folder, my hook folder, then scripts. All right, let's go to the download that we were looking at. Here it is. 
And we're gonna drag this over here. All right, so there we have it. And I already have the game running. So I wanna see if it comes up with me already having the game running or do I need to restart? So let's see, plugin manager. Uh, looks like I need to restart. Let's see if I turn this off and turn it back on. Nope. I need to restart for sure. Okay, so the camera stuff should come up here when I restart. If you don't know how to get to this menu, it's just pressing F8. When you get in game, as long as you have the hook properly installed, then it will work. So let's turn off the game. I've already moved my camera mod, uh, this camera script file, Lua script. So I'm gonna go to my download folder and just delete this for now. Deleted that out of my downloads folder. All right, so if you're not able to keep up or if you're having trouble, make sure you go back and watch that last little bit again. But I am going to restart my game now. I noticed some of you uh, have been saying, hey, I follow all your steps. Uh, but sometimes if you're new to modding, it takes a little more than just following the steps I have in that particular video. Sometimes you need to go back and start from the very beginning of how to install mods, okay? So if you're new to mods and you don't have you don't have any mods working, you're gonna need to check out my videos called How to Install Mods. All right, now we're back in the game. Let's press F8. I'm gonna go to Plugins, Plugin Manager, and as you can see, the free camera plugin comes up. So this is gonna be great. It's already running. Now you need to have hook version 0, 0 0.15. And I guess now would be a great time for me to show you guys where to go to find, you know, updates on the hook. You can go to NLSC forums and I'll show you what that looks like. You can see the address up here, but go to NLSC forums. And as of right now, this is the layout. So I'm going to come over here to the 2K22 section. You can click on modding or you can go through this. I'll click on 2K22. Come on. All right. And then, then I could. I mean, it's nothing down there for me right now. I just wanted to show you guys how to navigate through this. But I'm going to come over here to NBA 2K22 modding. And here it is. Here is the thread that you want to click on for any possible updates. It looks like the last update was on January 31st. So I'm going to click here. If you don't have the hook, make sure you come here and download this okay if you do have the hook you don't have to worry about downloading this and i told you guys i was going to tell you about plugins and scripts uh so here's another script slash plugin uh this one right here allows you to have have the option to force player portraits to show up you know sometimes when they get traded the game then takes away some of their portraits but you can force the player portraits to show up headband options unlock shoes etc etc that's one of his scripts but anyway um this particular script here you need to have you're absolutely, and I know some of you are probably getting confused by this video. I just want to say, you need to have, you, you should have, by now, you should have this version of the hook, which will give you all these menus and everything that we've been looking at, all right? All right, so let's get in game and let's test this out. I'm going to press F8 to close off that menu, and I actually, you know what? Let's see, do I have, uh, let's close that. Let's go to mods, mod resources. All right, 
what I'm going to do here, I'm going to turn on the high school mod because I want to test this out and really see if this works to the, the degree that I would like it to work. All right, let's go to play now. Quick play. I'm going to load up a high school roster, which is the EYBL slash 2K DNA. All right. Just find a team. You know what? I'll do this. Sorry, guys. Here we go. We're going to go with this, guys. All right. Let's uh, get Team Mello over here. No, Team Hero, actually. All right. So let's get into the game. Hopefully their jerseys are working. It doesn't matter. I just need to get into the instant replay. All right, come on guys. I'm not here for 2K TV. I don't know how many seasons this man played. All right, so just to keep, you know, the conversation going so you guys don't get bored and leave the video. Remember, what we're doing is now we're testing this camera. All right. All right. So I just need to get in game. Get in game. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, let's see. Instant replay. Let's see, how far back can I go? All right, he has removed the limitations of the replay camera. So how much can I zoom in? All right, this is how much I can zoom in. This is great. Because now we can get details that we were previously unable to get, get angles that we were previously not able to get, such as shoes. Before, it was such a hassle let me show you so I can get right here on the floor and get into shoes and take photos of shoes if I would like. You know, that's another aspect of it. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Now, where is my little guy? Uh, he doesn't have his shoes on this game. Okay, cool. Anyway, you can get really close in on these jerseys. You can zoom in on these details. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, let me back up. I'm zooming in to people's crotch, and it's not what I'm trying to do. And this could be cool for, let me see. Let's, let's get some footage, some moving footage. Just want a true kid with the ball. Oh. All right, my here's my my player Brody. Be good. Let's bring it back out. See if we can chain together some moves. All right, nope. All right, I just wanted some footage. Let's see. Let's go to a angle. Just want them moving around. Let me see. Here we go. No, I don't want to follow the ball. I want to follow this player. All right. So, how much can I zoom in on them? Yeah, you can make some good mixtapes here with these kind of views. You can get some really good screenshots. Look at this. And then even, you know what? I should call the timeout. Let me see. I'll show you. All right. So you see how everybody's standing up. Let's see if I can call the timeout. Call timeout. Get the players going to the benches and stuff like that. Let it play out. Don't skip through it. 
All right, instant replay. Now, with us being able to get a little bit closer, see what we're looking like. We can get some good team portraits, probably. Yeah, this stuff is great. Right, let's come down here and check out these guys. So, yeah, I've shown you guys how to install this, giving you a live example. If you're having issues, try restarting the video and only watching the parts of the video that matter to you. Okay? I've gone over as much as I can in this video. Sometimes you guys are not able to do the same things I'm doing just because uh, you may have some information that you're missing that uh, I didn't actually cover in that particular video. That's usually where people run into issues. But I don't see anybody doing anything special on this. Nobody showing any emotion. So, but you when when you have those times of people showing emotion, now you can like, you can really get the screenshots, the type of screenshots that 2K takes. All right. All right, let's leave it at that. And that is the end of this video.